Mexico is the nesting ground for at least five out of seven sea turtle species worldwide. Between the months of May to September in the popular vacation towns of Tulum and Cancun, endangered turtles like the loggerhead and green turtles are setting up nests on the beach. Volunteers like the one in our next film, Aurora Dawn, patrol the nest to make sure every baby turtle makes it to safety. Their sanctuary is one of the largest in the country. So come along to see what it takes to help protect a species at the brink of extinction. This is Aurora Dawn from filmmakers Emilio Alvarez and Daniel Mendoza. afternoon, we count the eggshells and rescue turtles that get stuck at the bottom of the nests. Most of them have barely a few hours outside of the egg, and getting them out to safety until nightfall is their only chance to ever reach the sea. Sometimes, we have to dig around three feet deep to find them, and even though a lot of them don't make it, it's worth the effort. At the camp, we patrol the beaches every night in the search of sea turtles that come to nest so we can have an accurate record of all the specimens that come to Schcassel each year. You can be burned out, but being surrounded by everyone getting ready somehow lifts your spirits up. <laughs> You walk through the beach, feeling the sand on your feet, the wind in your face, hoping for it to be a windy night that keeps the mosquitoes away. You feel connected to the sea, the stars, and wait for the first sea turtles of the night to appear. Loggerhead and green sea turtles come to the shores of Gazelle to nest, both endangered species. Some can take over two hours nesting and can lay more than 120 eggs. The immense effort forces them to stop constantly, but only to take a deep breath and carry on with determination. We don't just take measurements, we also protect them from any adverse situation that could happen along the way. To witness how they end in these beaches, such a long and rough journey always leaves me in awe. They're completely free. They go wherever they want through the vast ocean. However, they always come back. They never forget their home. To be part of this program, you have to be able to adapt, sleep little, have odd schedules, but it's easier when you're a company. We're volunteers of all ages and all parts of Mexico who have come together to put all our energy in the protection of this natural sanctuary. <laughs> Chcacel is a very attractive place for tourism, 
And even though it's a natural protected area, it is constantly endangered by resorts and real estate firms. That's why this conservation project is so important. At dusk, when frigate birds leave, the newborn sea turtles can hatch safely. On one side, the immensity. On the other, the tenderness of the newborn sea turtles going towards the sea. It's incredible to see how it all coexists in the same space. For every thousand sea turtles that cross the beach, only one will come back as an adult. But that doesn't stop them. They just hatched, they're new in this world, and they go straight to adventure, to the toughest and longest journey of their lives. The sea rolls them over, but they keep fighting to get to their destination, guided by the moonlight. That perseverance is inspiring. The nights are always long and exhausting, but all this tiredness disappears with dawn, and you feel part of the landscape. You can't stop thinking about the little sea turtles and the journey they just started. Deep down, you feel very happy for them, and you feel proud for the work you've done. A new day begins and you know you're doing the right thing. <laughs>